Justin Morgenstein, you're next. Nate Bauer, you're third. John, what are the keys to winning a game like that where things aren't clicking offensively? Um, I think it's getting stops. But I, I was telling the team earlier, we uh, I think we scored one more point at Wisconsin, but we lost by like uh, 15, should have been 20. So we can win games when we score 55, 56 points. It's, just, it's about getting stops and not getting down and stuff, keeping positive body language and knowing that we're going to be in this game in the final four minutes. Justin Morgenstein, let's come to you. Nate Bauer, you're on deck. John, kind of piggybacking off that, you guys don't let up a bucket for the last 732 of that game. You know, How exactly are you and your teammates able to lock in defensively in those big minutes down the stretch? I think uh, it, our practice carried over. Um, we went hard yesterday during practice. We went hard yesterday during practice, and uh, that showed that got our edge back, uh, our defensive edge. And it's just a one-two. I think defense rebounding, it's a one-two. Offense will come naturally, and you can score, you can hit threes, but with defense and rebound, you got to want to do it. It's got to be a mindset. Bauer, let's come to you. Corey Geiger, you're on deck. John, is there is there an adjustment made to to your mentality or your psyche? I guess when when shots aren't falling, like I mean, is there a point? I guess in the game where it's just where it becomes evident to you guys that you're not going to play a typical Penn State style of basketball game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. I think uh, one thing. Uh, Good props to Maryland. I think they're a tough team. They're not the biggest team in the Big Ten, obviously. Like, they don't have the seven-footer that everyone else has. But they're a tough team, and they kept us out of the paint. So I think our message in halftime was we got to touch the paint. We got to get paint touches, and then that will lead to better uh, threes if we want to take threes or it will get us to the foul line like it did. So I think it's a different style of basketball we played today, but uh, we still came out with the win. Cool, Bagger, let's come to you next. Evan Patrick, you'll be afterward, and I think that'll end our session. I don't see any other hands up. John, Jim Ferry speaks of you like you are Superman. <laughs> and the greatest pro – I'd like to ask you about Jim Ferry and the mm -hmm. job that he has done and what he means to you guys taking over in all of this stuff and having you here you know, on the bubble. Uh, just what, what, what do you make of the job he's done? Yeah, I love Coach Ferry. Uh, it's funny because all my friends and family uh, tell me, and they see all this stuff over the media, like Jim Fer Coach Ferry uh, says he wants you to marry his daughter. It's all this crazy stuff. He he. I just talked to him five minutes before I came, and he just he always says of like not even the basketball player I am, but the human being. And I think that speaks to him because he sees us as human beings. He doesn't see us as basketball players. Uh, he came – he's he's a great coach. Uh, I love Coach Ferry, and the relationship I built with, with him will last forever. Kevin Patrick, let's come to you for the last question of this session. Hey, John, I wanted to ask you about Miles. I mean, he's been getting increasing minutes at the four um, these last handful of games, closing out games. What what makes it work so well, him playing the four, even though he's a guy who's six four and has played two guard a lot in his career here? Miles is a big body, so he can uh, – he can. I think they tried posting him up with Dante Scott four possessions in a row, and Miles held his own. Uh, he can carry his weight, and he can uh, he can be a force in the paint. And also, I know Jamari said, but his IQ, I think Miles is one of the smartest players, and his shot-making ability when it comes down to the final 30 seconds, as we know. He's going to hit those two free throws. I think he has, like, three game winners here at Penn State, so – it's a lot of trust that's built in uh, to Miles when it gets in under two minutes. And that's a perfect place to end it. Thanks, everyone.